Hi everyone, hope you're having a great weekend. It's great to connect with you again. Hard to believe we only have two more weeks before the February vacation and our students and staff are really excited about the 100th day of school. It's coming up this Thursday. And uh, also just wanted to remind uh, students that uh, we are continuing on with our book madness voting. So I put some information in the newsletter this week. I want to thank Ms. Hopkins, Ms. Clegg, and Ms. Esposito for all their hard work uh, organizing and planning our book madness we have so many tremendous readers here at Sherwood uh, and excited to, for students to get involved in this fun activity, so make sure you check that out. Also a reminder that you can sign up for Unified Basketball. This is the second time that we are offering this. We did this once prior to COVID, although we were not able to have that season due to COVID, so we're excited to be opening up that opportunity again. Uh, please check out that information in the newsletter. Uh, also, we are excited about some upcoming events. We have a kindness week that we are planning. Our student advisors are helping us plan the themes for those days. That's going to be the week before February vacation. Uh, also wanted to wish a special congratulations and a big thanks to our counselors. This is National School Counseling Week. Uh, I would ask our parents, if you have an opportunity, uh, take maybe five minutes, ten minutes out of your week uh, to send a nice, thoughtful email to our school counselors for, for the tremendous work they do each and every day, supporting your child both with their academic needs and their social-emotional needs. I'm going to ask our students to do that as well this week. Make sure you take some time out of your week to thank them either in person or maybe take an opportunity to write them a nice note. That goes a long way. And we, are, of course, are talking about our core value this month, which is kindness. I've been talking a lot about what are those little things we can do, especially this year as we continue to persevere uh, through this challenge, uh, of how we can come together as a community. And that, of course, is what makes Sherwood such a unique special and great place to be is that we all support each other uh, through this. So I'd ask our students to do that. And thanks to our families for all of your support. Reminder that we have a PTO meeting this Monday night at seven. That is on Zoom. Uh, I'd love for you for more uh, families to join us with that. And we also have a school council meeting this Friday. Thanks to those parents that take part uh, in those activities. Uh, once again, just uh, again, grateful to our students for their ongoing perseverance, to our staff for continuing to develop meaningful and engaging lessons with our students. And of course, thank you to our families for all of your support. And again, as I said to our students, make sure you are getting excited for our 100th day of school this week. I hope that you come out and get excited and maybe dress up. There will be some great prizes for those students who come out and celebrate with positivity and creativity for the 100th day this Thursday. That's it for me. Hope you have a great rest of your weekend and look forward to connecting with all of you soon. Take care.